The year is 2020. After the lockdown of unknown virus, everyone succumbs to the memes and streams for human contact. You have only two choices in life now. You either go outside to buy yourself instant ramen and toilet paper while risking getting infected or you become fanboy streamer spamming cringe memes on TikTok. Ordering DoorDash for every meal you devour like an animal. Streets aren't empty, infected people spamming on Twitter roam everywhere. But there is another way, you can become a hunter. A hunter is someone either stupid or crazy enough to go outside without the mask. Folks say they are immune to the disease, but some of them succumb to the infection in time anyway, becoming dangerous mutated beasts. When it's dark, you can hear their screams outside, crying for someone to end their misery. You are Vaifu. You are born of the monster energy, made sponsorships by the Red Bull, and done by Rockstar. Our eyes yet tired. Feel the G fuel. To the east, all I see in my dreams is defeat So I creep in the streets and I bleed from my goddamn teeth I Am Vaifu is the game of all time It features massive cities somewhere in Europe Packed with details and hidden secrets You play as Vaifu of your choice Which you can customize however you like But please don't press this button It does nothing important, trust me While TikTok people roam the streets You go out on rampage and destroy virus hives And end this madness of 2020 The game features vast array of weapons From shotguns to automatic rifles To powerful sniper rifles The story is very ambiguous And you have to carefully read every item description to fill out the plot holes devs left in the game. They also left various old world paintings on the walls of Philidor as a part of environmental storytelling of how it used to be and even in post-apocalyptic reality some artists put their souls on the walls of the city for it to remember the times where it all went to shit. But even with that the story is very enigmatic and you actually had to be there in the first place to know what really happened. But it's a folk tale and everyone you meet will have something different to add. That's the beauty of the game and year 2020 where no one really knows what happened but everyone knows different things that happened. The saddest part is that the game never ends. You can upgrade your gear and fight off the holes but it will never stop. Will we ever see better tomorrow? Will I be able to go outside once more? Not that I was doing it before the outbreak. Will Hunter Vaifu become my wife? I will never know, cause I am infected. I wrote this story as my last piece of humanity for the world. The end is near, I can feel it coming. There is less and less Vaifu hunters out there, and more of them become beasts. No one is safe.